What's up, SM? We have quite a show for you today, starting with Entertainment with Charlie, a back-to-school dance recap, a walk-on from the mock trial team, and finally, girls' volleyball team is here to tell you about their upcoming home game. I hope you guys all have your seatbelts on because this show is going to be a wild ride. America's newest Roman Catholic high school is open this week in Orange County. Good morning, SM. I'm Loria Blake. And I'm Sam Borsellino. Before we get into the actual show, we have a few announcements. Are you an upcoming freshman or transfer interested in joining the diving and swim team? If so, there will be a short meet and greet meeting today at 2 p.m. on the school pool deck. Our second announcement is for eSports. They're having tryouts tomorrow. They also have a new broadcasting program, and if you're interested in and streaming and team to comment in on, their man on their managed games. If you have no experience at all, no worries because no experience is necessary. Lastly, if you're interested in game development, the new art team would be perfect for you. To join any of these opportunities, please contact esports at smhs.org. L'Oreal, did you watch any good movies over the summer? You know what, I did. Um, I watched Elvis, and you wanna know what? It was such a good movie, especially with Austin Butler, because he's such a good actor. He's amazing. I love that movie, too. But my favorite summer movie was Purple Hearts, The Rise. You know what, Sam? We don't have time for this. Charlie, take it away with her, your entertainment, because her movie list is way too long. Good morning, Santa Margarita, and happy Tuesday. Welcome to the first entertainment update of the year. I'm Charlize Haddad, your entertainment reporter. Because summer just ended, let's talk about some of this summer's best movies. First off, the Top Gun movie. Top Gun Maverick, starring Tom Cruise, came out at the end of our school year on May 16th. This movie is the second Top Gun movie following the 1986 version. In this movie, the famous Navy pilot Maverick is called back into Top Gun to teach a group of students a special mission. If you haven't already seen this movie, you can still see it in theaters or on HBO Max. Next up, let's talk about the newest Minion movie, The Rise of Gru. The Minion movie came out on July 1st and was very popular not only with little kids but also with teenagers. This movie goes back to when Gru was younger, trying to join a group of supervillains. The interview doesn't work out, so Gru and the Minions follow the group around, trying to get invited back. This movie is still in theaters or available on Apple TV, Amazon Prime Video, and a few other streaming services. Lastly, let's talk about my personal favorite, the Elvis movie. Elvis, starring Austin Butler and Tom Hanks, came out on June 24th. This movie goes over Elvis Presley's life and rise to fame along with his manager, Colonel Tom Parker. Something you might not know about the Elvis movie is that it was actually filmed in Australia. And one of my favorite fun facts is that the actor who played Elvis, Austin Butler, still has his accent from filming the movie. The Elvis movie is still on theaters, but it also was released to HBO Max on August 9th, so you can watch it there too if you haven't already. That is all I have time to tell you guys about today. I am Charlize Haddad, and let's send it back to the host. Wow, Charlie, thank you. A lot of those movies actually have great soundtracks. Yeah, Top Gun soundtrack was my go-to all summer. You know, Sam, I've been wondering, what is your favorite song to dance to? I don't really dance L'Oreal, so I don't have one. So you're telling me you didn't dance at the back to school dance? That's honestly kind of lame of you, Sam. Okay, well that's not what I mean, but I'm pretty sure we have a back to school dance recap in store for us. Let's check it out. so sad that I missed that dance. Yeah, it was honestly so fun. L'Oreal, is that my necklace? This is my necklace. No, it's my necklace. No, it's mine. We, we might need to take, take this to court. court. 
Oh, you know what, L'Oreal? This isn't about us taking each other to court. Why don't we let Sarah take away about what she does in court? Hi, SM. My name is Sarah Burton. I'm a senior here and a part of our school's mock trial team. Now, if you've never heard of mock trial, that's okay because I'm here to explain it. Every year, the Constitutional Rights Foundation creates a new court case for local high schools to read over and eventually compete in the form of a trial. Our cases have dealt with a multitude of different criminal charges, and fortunately, we have an amazing group of coaches to help with one private practitioner, two public defenders, two district attorneys, and a superior court judge. Now, if you're a fan of popular movies and TV shows such as Legally Blonde or Law and Order that feature memorable court scenes, or are interested in becoming a lawyer or a judge, or are involved with, um, or are involved with a social justice debate or acting of any kind, then mock trial is for you. We have our first meeting this Wednesday at 3 p.m. At, in G307, and we would love for you all to be there. Pizza will be provided. If you have any questions, feel free to contact either me or our faculty advisor, Mr. Minton. Have a great rest of your day, SM. Wow, that's actually a lot of information to take in. I hope you guys consider joining mock trial. Yes, definitely. Sam, don't you play volleyball? I actually do. It's a really fun sport. Well, Sam, we actually have some of our volleyball girls here to talk about their upcoming home game. Take it away, girls. Hey, Eagles. My name is Grace Moss, here with some of our other varsity volleyball players. And we are calling all of you guys to be there tomorrow at our home game against Sierra Canyon at 6 o'clock. It's going to be a huge game, mini rivalry, so we hope to see you all there. See you at six. Go Eagles! <laughs> Go Eagles. <laughs> oh shoot, Sam. Look at my watch. I think that's all the time we have for today, Eagles. But make sure to tune into tomorrow's show where we will have a movie review, a sports update, and a football walk-on. I'm Sam Borsellino. And I'm Loria Blake. Have, have a, a wonderful, wonderful rest of your day, day and see you next time. time.